Hello, this is Ryan from Shenzhen Daofang Electronics Company Limited. Today, I will show you how to do the batch upgrading for the access control panel with the body uh, temperature detection and the face recognition. So, first of all, if you want to do the batch upgrading, you need to have the routers. So, there are two kinds of routers in the market. One is the simple like this, mostly used in the families and for in the office, just have four port. So this kind of the, you can see here, it only have four uh, output, uh, this four gig, four gigabyte LAN ports. So that means maximum he can do four cameras upgrading at the same time. So if you just buy a few pieces, maybe one or two pieces, you could use these routers. But if you are uh, buying large quantity, like 20 pieces, 50 pieces, or 100 pieces, you need to buy one machine like this. So maximum like this one, have 52 uh, ports. That means you can upgrade 50, 50 cameras or access control panel at the same time. So this based on what's come and the quantity you have on the machine in hand to do the mass or the batch upgrade. Okay, this is a product or the things you need to prepare in advance. This is the new upgrading tool. Next, the previous is PC, P config. Now it's bconfig. This is the new upgrading tool. And the same, use the exe file. Then you could search. So this is the camera access control panel which connect to in my office. I only have one in hand, so I just show for one. But if you have two or more, and you have this switch machine, then you connect all the cameras or the panel with the this machine, then you can search maybe two, 50, 15, 10, or five pieces, as maximum as you can. Then you choose this and do the you can see the here you can you need to uh, separate to set the IP camera IP address for each camera so you can mm, choose all the cameras you have and the, to set the IP for each one like this one is 88 the next one is 89 the next one is 90 91 92 until 100 100 200 so each one should be different so have low confidence after this, you can uh, start upgrading. This is the file. It's the same as last one, but this time is different. You can, you don't need to do it one by one. In the uh, previous software, you can, you need to, can only do one or few pieces at the same time, and you need to follow the steps one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You need to do the all, but this time you could just input this this file, the XML file, XML file to this. Then you could to choose the file here and the root of the file. So you could just choose the last file and start upgrading. So it's already started. You can see how it's going on in the machine or the process. So you can see this is much faster than the previous. So this time you can see we have the 10, 9 here. We started at uh, 7, uh, nine, 9 o'clock, 7. So let's see how long does it take. Of course it takes uh, about, uh, I think it's uh, 5 to 8 minutes, nearly 8 minutes. Last time is about 30 minutes. So even though here it shows is filed, not in filed, it's same. 
and, and, and then here you can see if this place the 30% 31 it's moving on it's fine so no need to even though here it says it failed ignore it no need to worry every time it's uh, input one package fail it was restarted so it was your login file but it was turn on and continue to upgrading work so 34 Okay, now it shows up really successfully. So this is finish it. So, well, even so, you need to search it again. So we can see we begin at seven and finish at fourteen. So only takes seven minutes, eight minutes to finish one camera, one access control panel. So you need to search and do the restore factory settings. So here we can see it shows up. So we just choose this one and restore. And it says restore fact factory settings successfully. And which one, the camera, which camera. So up this, this is done. So this already successfully upgrade and we can log into the cameras right now. This time we have updated a lot of the uh, details in the camera. In the previous version, it only can support Internet Explorer, uh, the, this, this browser, the oldest uh, browser, this one. But the, pre the present version, we can use any route, uh, browsers like the Google or Microsoft uh, or this. So we could just log in. And then we could input the password. And then you can see it's already upgraded. So this time um, you could just choose the language here. For example, if you just see Italian, you choose the Italian and then save. And then the camera will, re will restart it again. After it's restarted, okay, it's ready to go. So this is the uh, how to upgrade the access control panel for the with the new tool. Okay, this two file I was sent to you by WeTransfer or by email or by WhatsApp. I was sent you to the zip files, so you just use this, the tool and the package file, all those. And this is a new version, it's 1.12. The previous is different, so it's upgrading every month. And uh, But it's already much mature than the previous one. Okay. This is how to do it. So a lot of things was uh, upgraded and improved. So you can use the Google or any other browsers and you can, you need to, if you want to do a large quantity, I would suggest you buy one of this kind of machine. So you could do uh, 50 pieces one time in seven minutes. So that is a quick job. Okay, that's so much for, thanks for your listening and thanks for your watching. Thank you, see you.